much better feed our ICU patients. And of course we have to take into account that we may not overfeed our patients, but using early enteral nutrition it's almost impossible to overfeed the patient and we can preserve the condition of the gut. So my first aim is to give my ICU patients some enteral nutrition and to target full enteral nutrition in the first 72 hours. If that's not feasible, and we know now uh, due to recent studies that have been published, that if we not achieve these goals after five or seven days, we can add some supplemental parenteral nutrition. But my main focus still will be use the gut when it's possible to use and I feed through the stomach. And we can do much better. We know we feed them almost 70 to 80% of target and that must be better in the future.